Hello again. Morning. We're inside, indoors this time. Um, listen, before we go through trends, papers and stuff, uh, just to let you know that the red weather warning has actually been extended. It was originally down to three o'clock today. It's now been extended until six o'clock this evening. So uh, weather-wise, all I can tell you now is just keep an ear to the radio today. We'll keep you up to date as best we can. But uh, as you probably have seen, if you haven't already from our previous video, Storm Emma did arrive and the snow is fairly thick. Um, it's it's lovely, it's really nice, but yeah. it is very thick outside, just be aware of that. It's really thick, it's actually, if you don't have to be somewhere today, you know, and it's not, um, like, making things difficult for mm. you, it's lovely to just walk in it. Yeah, it's, it's actually nice yeah. to get out and have a bit of crack in. Uh, it's One lovely. of us was throwing snowballs this morning. At the other of us. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so, yeah, so we stayed in town last night. Uh, we stayed in the Ash Hotel, which is just across the road from where we work, and uh, so we had a really short walk. Uh, what would it be? A couple of hundred meters? Oh, just a few hundred meters, yeah. yeah it took us about a quarter of an hour. Yeah. But that, that was more so because I was messing. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay. So the papers today, as you'd imagine, we don't have any physical copies of the papers uh, yet this morning. The Irish Examiner is not printing today for the first time in, we think, over 100 years. Yeah, it's nearly 100 years, I think. Yeah. If, if it's not nearly 100 years, it might be just a little bit over, yeah. Yeah, so, uh, but all the papers are operating online, obviously. Um, sad story in the front page, or sorry, not the front page, one of the big stories in the Examiner today. A very sad story coming out of County Cork uh, last night. A teenager in a critical condition in Cork after a freak accident on the north side of the city. Uh, he fell. Uh, believed to have broken his neck so please do mind yourselves out there it's a dreadful story it's in the Irish Examiner today also um, in the web Irish Examiner's website uh, Caroline McHenry of the HR Suite was on Radio Kerry yesterday talking about the issues that employers and employees face in the current uh, weather crisis and what happens if you tell your employees they don't have to come into work or what happens if they just don't turn up to work as they can't well the status read weather warnings have highlighted the legal grey areas for firms responsibility for their employees employees uh, and that is uh, also in the examiner today an interesting read there um heavy snow and sub-zero temperatures ex expected to continue today storm emma is also on the front page of the irish times or the big story in the times today now this story about school closures at easter time andrew schools may not cut easter holidays over snow closures there's official guidelines now on allowing schools to shorten holidays to make up for lost tuition time so that's worth a read as well uh, the times the uk times Ireland edition they have printed uh, today, uh, photograph from Dublin on the front page, beast set to stalk country for second day is the headline. And then in other news that's not weather related, the government must be delighted with the bad weather when it comes to this story because it's really falling under the radar. Uh, the way in which government advertisements are displayed in newspapers is set to be reformed and they're getting away lightly with that one, I think. Um, it's store members ruining people's chances of getting married, Andrew. Yeah, there's weddings apparently today. That one woman on the RT News last night said, uh, I, I don't care, but my daughter will be married at half past two tomorrow <laughs> there I had to move from Kilkenny to Waterford but they're going to do it <laughs> that was by the way that was not her accent at all uh, oh yeah I was going to say yeah. what because in case they got up to it tonight is it <laughs> they have to be married today <laughs> they will be married today. Um, it's very cold out there you would need to be snuggling up like uh, you would yeah. you definitely need to have a bit of a cuddle I'd say although we did find out earlier in the week and I don't know if we said this on air supposedly it's really bad for your sex life the, re the bad weather Yes, we yeah we we said it here on the video definitely anyway yeah. Uh, is it because people wear really unattractive stuff to bed? Possibly yeah. Yeah yeah, like wearing a polo neck to bed or something. Or like a big woolly jumper. Or like a Game of Thrones. Some sort thing. of animal. An animal thrown over you <laughs> in bed. <laughs> that is sure to be good. Anyway, we're totally sidetracked. That's for the different video that we do. We do those videos at night. Um, Storm Emma has ruined a woman's uh, dream wedding, and her namesake is Emma. Ironically enough. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, Brilliant. yeah, there she is, Emma O'Kane. Lovely. And uh, look, it's just all the weather. I know. I was going to keep yeah, talking. Yeah, the, the, the trends this morning are also weather. The only one that's not weather related is World Book Day, which was yesterday. Uh, the other trends then are Storm Emma, Snowmageddon slash Schnachtageddon. And Christmas is trending this morning because um, there's a peep. There's people in Waterford and Wicklow have put up Christmas trees outside for the crack. <laughs> um, by the way, shout out to the person if you're watching this uh, who. Built a snowman outside the Lee Strand car park next door to Radio Kerry here. Uh, I took a picture, which I'll stick up on later, later on. We're going to have some uh, competitions this morning as well for um, 
snowmen and that kind of crack. So we'll have a bit of a laugh at that. But on the serious side of it, then we'll also keep you up to date with what's happening. We have an update from the council, which we're going to go through on the radio as well in just a few minutes' time. So there's loads happening on the show as well this morning. We want to see photographs. We want to see the worst snowmen in Kerry. Photos, please. WhatsApp them to 083 300 3300. Uh, just like mind yourselves out there. Have yeah. the crack if you can. Like it'd be lovely to let the children play in the snow. But be, um, safe, yeah. but be safe about it. And bookies have slashed the odds of a white Easter from 20 to 1 to 8 to 1. Is this a thing? It is now. It's a thing now, yeah. Right, listen, contact us here or text or WhatsApp as usual, 083 300 3300. And have a good day and a safe day. And enjoy the snow in the best way possible, all right? Yeah, share your pics with us. We'd love to see them in videos too. Talk to you soon, guys. Morning. Bye.